I left school with no qualifications and no real aspirations to achieve or do anything constructive. I had no drive or ambition and ultimately started taking drugs. I became addicted to heroin and set out on a pattern of self-destruction that would characterise most of my twenties. I always knew I was bright, I just felt that the chance to better myself had slipped away forever. I came across college after I had my final warning at work. After going through various treatments, I ended up getting a job at a call centre and I worked there for like for five years. I was always reading and getting into trouble for reading, I was reading history books and my manager, she just stopped me and she just says, you're better than this, you know, you, you, you're better than all this, you know, you need to go and do something with yourself or you'll be out of a job in a week. Lee came on our full-time course, which is an access to higher education course. Learning is about evolving and moving forwards and, and using what you've done. From my initial interview where I was nearly brought to tears through being told it's okay Lee, you can finally blossom now, through to the challenging issues faced daily being president of the student union, it was Northern College and FE that provided the guidance and support that allowed me to grow. It was exhilarating to finally be able to just be around people that encouraged me, just it felt like I'd come home. Just living at college meant I was away from negativity and old habits. It meant I could study prodigiously if I wanted and I could start to let go of all the emotional baggage I had accumulated through my life. Surprisingly to me, and not so surprising to others, I was achieving top marks in my essays and I was on a high. We had a celebration with our local MPs and local dignitaries and Lee gave the most amazing speech. There were really were people in tears and the MPs at the end leapt up to congratulate him. Um, and I think David Blunkett said to him, you know, you ought to go into politics. That was amazing. The support that college has given me has been outstanding. I found the transition into higher education to be seamless. It got me a place at Sheffield Hallam University studying modern history. I originally wanted to teach history. The second path's opened up into politics. It's, I've got another two years, maybe more at university, so I could, yeah, the world's my oyster.